Hi, I'm Ivan Stevenson. Um, I'm honestly here at University of Florida down in Gainesville, and uh, this is our University of Florida concrete canoe area, and I am the construction captain. I'm also a fourth year uh, civil engineering student at the University of Florida, and so this is basically where we construct, build, and I guess you could call it manufacture our canoes. So anything from hole design, mold testing, any sort of mixed design as well, all the way to finally standing and sealing the boat and uh, getting ready for competition. Yeah. So uh, for the most part, this is our competition canoe for this year. And uh, we'll be bringing this uh, lady to uh, nationals out in uh, Illinois, Champaign, um, June 20th and 22nd. And we're hoping to you know, do pretty well. Uh, we got first place at uh, regionals in order to qualify. And uh, so far, it's been a pretty good year for us. Also kind of a small world, I should guess I should say, because there's about 20 teams per region, and there's definitely a couple regions. So at the national level, we get down to about another 20, 20 canoes. So if you have like 20 regions, 20 canoes, you've got a lot of schools competing. But uh, we're actually friends with a lot of people in Florida. We actually deal a lot with uh, UCF, USF people, and they're always asking questions about shot crate, and we told them just to go to water sprayer. <laughs> Yeah, so this is our models. Um, we go ahead and do about one six scale. So essentially this is Conquistador or our competition canoe for this year. Just about one six the size, so it's almost three feet in length. And so we drag this in the flume and we measure basically, uh, we record the times at certain weights that are pulling on it. And that's how we compare it to other models and we say, you know, this one's the best because it went the fastest. Photos here, um, we'll start with, uh, this is our mixer. It's basically just a, it's almost like a baking mixer. I think it's what it actually is. And so we use that, and so you can see he's mixing there. Um, and once we've got it mixed, we can you know, go ahead and hand place the rib sections, or we can go ahead and shock read the first layers. Um, this is our reinforcement that we're applying. This is carbon uh, fiber Kevlar mesh. And then uh, this is them finishing or trialing the outer layer to give us a, give us a better surface finish. And then once it was completed, we uh, actually did a sprinkler system this year. And so that allowed it to um, gain a lot of early strength. And then once we, once we were done with that, we went ahead and put it into an actual heated curing tank. And that led us to get, finish the 28 day cure process. And then once with that completed, we went ahead and uh, applied some stain and sealer to our competition canoe. And then it was ready to go. This year we also made two canoes, and this one is actually our practice canoe. This one is out at Lake Wahlberg, and we gave this to our paddlers in order to give them an idea of what they're going to be experiencing in the real canoe. I would be over here on port A and they would somehow, they would basically take their mixing bowl and they'd bring it to me and, I, and so they would fill it and then I would just go ahead through the process of spraying it on each layer. And so basically I would just try to take a look and make sure I was getting about an eighth of an inch was our target goal. And so um, it was actually a wonderful product to use also because it's very convenient and very easy to use. Um, really no difficulties at all. Um, it basically floats because the concrete that we are using is actually lighter than water. Um, the first two layers of our concrete is about 55 PCF and you know to give you an observation water is about 62.4 so it's lighter than water. And the outside layer we actually used uh, some latex mix and we got something like 34, 35 PCF so we got a really light layer on the outside. I'm up here this isn't solid concrete this is uh, basically foam flotation, or it's what we call flotation. So it's basically a foam block. And so that stuff's really light. If you can hold, you basically hold the whole block in your hand with one hand with no problem. And uh, so that just kind of helps us float in the event that, you know, a canoe should have somehow take on water. And so then it's just covered with a thin layer of concrete so it's not like really heavy up front or back or anything. This uh, pink thing that's kind of sticking out at you is um, our mold from this year. And so essentially what we do is we sort of spray concrete on the, on the outside of it and then we sort of lift it up with a jacking system and then we just pull the mold out from the concrete so it totally separates and then we can pick the canoe up and sort of go on our way with it. Um, so if you want to learn anything more about our team or if you want to get involved or uh, just contact us, you can find the, some links around here. I think they're somewhere on this screen. <laughs> and uh, you can visit our page and visit our website. So. row the thing and win the race, right? Right. Uh, 
All right, so who all is in the competition? Uh, there 